Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Let's Play Grim Fandango. Um, in the last episode, uh, many over here finally found Meche. We think we lost Gladys, although I'm not, I'm not so sure anymore because I do remember seeing that, you know, a little wreck of a ship down, you know, at the edge of the world, so maybe he actually survived down there? <laughs> I mean, it's really conveniently placed that has a lot of nothing, so... I assume there's a purpose to it. And, uh, yeah, so, um, and Mechi thinks that Manny is working for Domino, and to prove to her that, you know, Manny is not working for Domino, uh, he needs to hand her a gun, and, uh, Manny needs to get a gun somewhere. But first of all, let's check out if my theory about Gladys is correct. Because I am very curious. So it's this way... Ah, this way. Oh, and uh, uh, in the last episode, Manny got a really tiny hammer and uh, Meche's burnt stockings. Whoa, 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 this way. Uh-oh. Yes, uh-oh, indeed. Right, so, uh, and we gotta go this way, Manny. I would be very thankful if you, uh, you know, move around quicker. Cool, he got it. Ah, I was right! Gladys is alive. And, uh, I don't remember if this pedal used to be pried off, but, um, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think it was. And wow, there's a weird background over there. Eesh. Gladys! You're okay! Well, it hurt a little when I hit, but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, Carnal, I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. Listen! I ask you, is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. Yeah. So I'm curious, is this supposed to be our escape from this island? Because I actually don't remember quite clearly. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Ah. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good too. Okay, but we need to pull her up somehow. Oh wait, do you need a... <laughs> <laughs> Do you need this really tiny hammer or the stockings? Hey, need a hammer? <laughs> Maybe after dinner, if I have something stuck between my teeth. <laughs> what about the stockings? Hey, 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 come on, stockings, yes, burnt stockings. These are too nice for that. Oh, come on. Okay, fine, fine. Well, anyway, we have an escape plan somewhere with this thing. But we need to pull it up somehow. I'm not really sure how. Whoa, whoa, no, no, no! Oh, Manny! Manny! I was clicking the opposite direction! There you go. Apparently I have to double click over here. No, no. Okay, double click right over there. And he's gonna go slightly faster in that direction. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, fella. Get off there. Actually, I wonder if the ski plan has to do with that crane. You know what? Let's do that later. First of all, let's figure out if one of those worker boys can be traded with or talked with. Because I'm pretty sure they might need a tiny hammer. Oh. Stupid chisel. Oh, hi there. You weren't here before. freaking... To the moon, he says. I'll show him. I think he's talking about us. <laughs> Hi. Stupid Chisholm's a little overpowered by his chosen tools. Yeah, he seems to be. Chapito. Huh? Who? Oh, you is it? Why, I ought to look at my eyebrows. They look exactly the same, Chapito. Like Manny said. Well, he didn't say it, but the eyebrows. But I can see from here, they're exactly the same barnacle as they used to be. <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm. 
Right. Well, you really weren't standing in a very safe place. Well, neither are you right now, amigo. Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We, we are done traveling together. I work solo, my friend, and I walk alone. Nice drill. Drill? This here is a cordless high-speed reciprocating chisel. And look, it's a bust all. They usually don't give these to the new guys. How'd you get a bus stop? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's ah. the name of the game out here in the Big Reef. I guess I wasn't too far off about trading. Booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over the ocean floor. Jewelry, precious coins, you people and your fancy boats never know about it, because you just never stop and look. That tool looks a little overpowered for you. Overpowered? Nothing overpowers Chapito. If you say so. I guess I need to give the tiny hammer to you. <laughs> okay, I'll do that later. Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it all for this beauty. You traded jewelry and precious coins for a power tool? It's a bust all. I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? A drink? Well, okay, I can ask for a gun. Okay, that's our source. A hug, a boat. <laughs> a boat. A boat. There you go again with the boats. <laughs> you know I don't like them. Why do you have to needle me? What about a drink? A drink. Ha! We're swimming in the biggest drink there is. Drinks aren't a hot commodity down here. Sorry. A towel. Oh, yeah, that. My friend Gladys to be alive. What? What happened? He went over the edge. Oh, stay away from the edge, I tell you. It's dangerous. I've seen whole ships go over in my time. Their engines in full reverse, trying to drop anchor. But the current, you can't fight her. So stay back. Oh, is that why I had to reverse that um, thing? <laughs> How about a nice pair of stockings? A towel. Hey, you funny guy, chalkhead. A hug? Mm, nope, that's the one <laughs> thing I ain't got for you. <laughs> uh, a gun. Ooh, that's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? My turtleneck. My turtleneck? Oh, yeah. That is nice. Acrylic? No, it's all natural. Oh, too bad. Natural fibers are so uncomfortable underwater. I know, I know. When you got something worth trading, come see old Chapito. Well, you do your right. Apparently, I can give you the stockings. Chapito! <laughs> huh? Who? Me. What? Well, I got a long day. Garbage. Please, bust away. Oh, uh, still. Well, let me help you by giving you the tiny hammer <laughs> first, and then I'll give you the Yo, stockings. Pito, have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. But I'd sure love to give it a test drive. <laughs> See, little chipper, you're okay. <laughs> and it just took the little chipper. <laughs> Uh, thank you for the bustle, Blah, but um, dee, dee, yeah, dee, here's dee, a stocking dee, piece for you. Hey, Chappy, check out the hosiery. Say, these are real silk. Where'd you find them? I've been wearing them the whole time. You too? Well then, here's your new best friend. Ah, uh, my first Sproutella gun. Is it loaded? No. Hey, well, it's your hard to get. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, but... Wow, he wears silk stocking. Interesting. Okay, I don't want to know anymore. Bye, Chipito. I need to. Oh, what's this way? Oh, right. My least favorite. No, 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 no. Oh, no, not this. Manny, stop. Stop, Manny. Oh, no. Oh. Okay. Jesus Christ, I couldn't stop him before. Okay, I'm not going this way, ever. Ever. Bye, Chipito. Oh, Virginia. Yeah, I know, Virginia's uh, an interesting place to hang out, but 
Meche, we I have a gun. Or Manny has a gun. Come, let's talk to Meche. Give her a nice gun too. Okay, where is it? It's, ah, there it is. Meche? Oh, why'd you? Here. What oh, good's okay. a relationship without trust? True, a relationship without trust is about as empty as a gun without bullets. Guess you didn't realize a smart girl always keeps an extra round in her hat for mad days. Come on, let's go. Mitchie, you don't know what you- I know exactly what I'm doing, now move! For mad days? Jeez. <laughs> Would you just listen to my escape plan first? Trouble in paradise, kids. You're letting us go right now, or your boy Friday here gets it. Well, I hate to see you go, Manny, but, uh... The lady seems to have made up her mind. I'm serious, I'll shoot him. Fine, he really doesn't work for me anyway. But I thought he... I'll shoot you then. No, you won't. You're too good, remember? I'm not, I'm not good anymore. You've taken that out of me, keeping me a prisoner here. I'm gonna crack you open like a fake Ming boss. I'm gonna... Fake Ming boss? <sighs> Kid's all right. <laughs> She's a firecracker, but a night in the cooler usually dampens her fuse. Hmm. I don't like you, really. You're more you're more of a jerk than I thought. Smug too. Domino! Hey, sport, how's the uh, escape going? What did you do with her? I thought she needed a little uh, time out, that's all. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, okay, good. Well, I find whatever. Uh well I don't have a gun anymore, and I need to find Meche. Where did he put I'm her? I'm getting angry! Oh, this is new. It used to be different. It's, now it's... me, Meche! Yeah, I can hear you. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Anybody! Okay. I assume I can't open Anybody! it. Anybody! Must be a combination lock, but there are no numbers on it. Poor Don was never good with numbers. Hugsy! Oh, no, not this. Hugsy! Is there anybody out there? I don't see any difference or hear any difference. No, never mind. I don't really know the combination. Maybe the little boys might know. Hi, Angelitos. Hola, Angelitos. Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. Uh. <laughs> sure. Hey, would one of you children happen to have a gun? Yeah, we do. So stick him up. Let me see it. He doesn't have one. He's such a liar. Oh, yeah? Well, you're stupid. <laughs> Your light bulbs don't work. Your light bulbs all smell like boogers. Ha, ah, nobody thinks you're funny anymore. Oh, yeah? Well, everybody in this cage is smarter than you. Everybody except for you. Yeah, because I'm especially smarter than you. Jesus. In your dreams. <laughs> In your baby bed that's all wet, could you wet in it? Shut up, bed wetter! I said shut up! Oh my gosh. No, no, really. I have to sleep with an umbrella down here. Oh yeah? Well, at least I never asked Meche to marry me. What? <laughs> Miss Colomar, you're so pretty. Will you marry me? I never said that! Oh, Miss Colomar! They're terrible. Stupid baby blue beanie <laughs> bedwetter. Pugsy the Bugsy lies like a rugsy. Will you two just shut up? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Hola, angelitos. Hello, Mr. <laughs> mean Boss Guy. All of a sudden, you're just... <laughs> no plan. Meche just locked up for good. We're leaving without her. We can't, we can't leave without, without Meche. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um... <laughs> You <laughs> children just wait here and be brave with lots of details, okay? Okay. What? <laughs> okay, that was totally pointless. My gosh, but the kids, man. Let uh, me out! Okay, um... Uh, is there Let anything except this handle and this wheel? Uh, it's me, Meche! I think they're separate and, um... Let me out! Yeah. What is that? Ooh, I bet I could pick that. Hey! If oh. only I hadn't lost my union card in that poker game. Ooh, I'm I in bet here. I could pick Wait, that. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay. 
Okay, so you don't have anything constructive to say about I'm what exactly here. is that. How, how about we use a bus stall <laughs> instead of break, Help! you know, just to just break it instead of picking it? Oh, yes. I promise I won't pull guns on anyone anymore! I'm sorry I didn't trust you. Must have hit a major circuit. Hmm. But it looks like I've exposed the guts here. Ah. Can we, um... Do anything else to them? I wonder. Oh, wait. Ooh, I hate that sound. What did you do? I don't want to mess up my blade. No, no, no. What did you do? It just stuck in there and that's it? Those are the tumblers of the combination lock. Yeah? I can't move those by hand. I need this wheel. What about using the bus stall? Can't you, like, I don't know... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Destroy them or something and then open the door? Those tumblers must be made of a harder steel than the outer door. Oh, really? So I guess I have to use a scythe. Okay, uh... Well, since you stuck the scythe in there, let's see what this does. Okay, it moves the bottom one. Oh, there's a gap! Did you see it? Yeah, there's a gap! Maybe I have to make sure all of them have a gap. Oh, the next one moves. Ah, okay, I see, I see. Uh, I need to make sure this one has a gap. I think it's like that. Oh, now only one of the moves. Um, okay, so this is actually... Well, it's not as simple, but I guess I get it. Oh, the top one needs to be moved a little bit more, I feel like. One sec. Okay, that was a little too much. Okay, fine, this much. Now, let's move the middle one if I'm lucky. Okay, this works. Oh, it aligned itself perfectly. Okay, that didn't qu quite work. Maybe. Okay, let's try this. Uh, how about now, Manny? Will, uh, will busting it work now with the scythe, or do I have to move the one at the bottom a bit? Stay. Ah, worked. Can you open it now? Yes. Oh, that totally worked. All right, Mechi, you can come out now. Mechi? Where did she go? Okay, yeah, uh, this is like an archive. So it's a, a giant safe. Hmm, some sort of metal contact. Hmm, no, electrical current makes my marrow tingle. Do you want to bust it? <laughs> Uh, maybe. I already did that from the other side. Okay. Scythe it then? Disable the door for good. <laughs> Although, to be honest, electrical current, is that supposed to do anything? It goes up. Why would the door need an electrical current? I mean, it is a lock combination based. That did absolutely nothing. Well, I guess... Oh, or do you have to be touching the door? Because, you know, metal current and everything? You know what? We'll figure it out. What is this? Looks like years and years of coral harvest reports. This can't be what this secret safe is meant to hold. Mm. They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. They're all locked yeah, up. Yeah, okay, I got it. I got it. They're all locked up. Oh yeah, bust them actually. You have a bust doll. Ha! <laughs> bust doll my ass. Ah, uh, didn't work. Uh, scythe maybe? Just to check if it works. <laughs> I mean, it it has a, a thin blade. Hmm. Can't get in there with this. Ah, too bad. 
This spot, by the way, unnerves me. It's so precarious in here. Ooh, we got a, a, an axe. This must be the big chipper. The big chipper. I, it does looks like the big chipper. What about this guy? Man, people in the old days were huge. Oh, well, yeah. Maybe. Mechi, are you in there? It's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. Yeah, where did she go? Doesn't look like he'd enjoy a piggyback ride. Hmm, what about the hammer? What, what can you do with it? Oh, you can drag it. This it has to be in the center of the circle. Wait. I don't know. Go back. Okay, here. Ugh, it's a cosa is heavy. That Asokosa did did do nothing. Um Oh no, don't tell me I have to shut the door and actually Boy, the bus stall and I really did a number on that door. Oh, you're an idiot. Uh oh, oh Raul. I am so so sorry. Let me guess. I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this side. Ay ay ay. Well, we can now check if the scythe works because metal, a lot of metal. Oh, and uh, yeah, it, the door has a bit of that yellow thingy, so maybe that will work. Oh, that did. Manny, I knew you would. Why is that door closed? Uh, it was the only way I, uh, uh the wind. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just made her life worse, but I guess, um, fake safes <laughs> that's why they're all locked up quote marks hey this is my room go use up the air in your own room this looks like a bathroom uh, oh suitcases let me guess number nine tickets uh we get this thing a drain of some sort that vent is the only way out of here that i can see i guess i couldn't reach that vent <laughs> Even if I stood on Mitch's shoulders. Wouldn't it make more sense for me to stand on your shoulders anyway? Are you kidding? Look at your heels. <laughs> oh yeah, right. She would um puncture his shoulders. There's a shower a shower head? <laughs> that home plumbing sprinkler system looks like it's about to fall apart. Oh, it's a sprinkler. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought it was a shower head. I guess you can't I can't reach that high. Even with Mitch? <laughs> Doesn't look like she's cooled off yet. Yeah, I know. Let's talk to her later. What is this? What's in these cases? Take a look. It's all the double-end tickets Hector and Dom have stolen over the years. Each one stolen from a good soul, and now they just sit there. That's it. What? They just sit there. That's what's been bothering me. In the days when I was a hot salesman, I used to see double-end tickets all the time, and they move. What do you mean, they move? They become agitated around human souls, and the ticket that belongs to you will actually fly into your hand. But these tickets, and the tickets in that suitcase of Charlie's, it's like they're dead. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double-end tickets? Or maybe the owners are dead. How about that? They got the tickets, the owners are dead, so now they can use it or something. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases no, no, of counterfeit double-end tickets? I know that. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding oh, cases of counterfeit double-end tickets? Okay, there's a valve. Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. Okay, I'll do that later. Now, Meche, talk to Manny, please. Thanks for not shooting me. Look. I'm sorry. I should have trusted you. It's just that the past two years have been pretty tough, you know? Yeah. You look like you could use a nice ocean cruise. Still my travel agent, eh? Yeah. <laughs> you look like you could use a nice... Okay, Still never my mind. Travel Just gotta agent, get eh? out of here. Um, I guess I gotta use this. Maybe it will turn off the shower curtain thing. Or not. What does that do? Oh, I bet you can reach it with a scythe. Duh. Not this thing. It's way too up. But this. I don't want to mess up my blade. Does that do anything? Uh, 
Now, all we have to do is wait for the room to fill up, and we'll just float on out of here. Oh, you can try well, that. This is disappointing. Not to me. We don't float, remember? <laughs> uh, what does that do? Does it go this way? Although, wait. One sec. Thank you. Ha. Huh. The water just disappeared. You look like you could no, still no, my no. travel no, no, agent, no. eh? The water just disappeared. It didn't stay on. Oh, not again. Thank you. Yeah, this is weird. Is that why I need the hammer? <laughs> Let me guess. Now I need to drag it all the way down there onto the one of the tiles. Let's try it then. Somewhere here in the center. Ah! You got it! It's over there. Okay. After you. What about the suitcases? Forget them. They're counterfeit. They wouldn't fit through this hole anyway. Let's go! Okay. And she goes. Oh. Okay, you get the kids, and I'll meet you back here with the boat. What boat? Well, I'm working on that. Okay, Manny. <laughs> okay, so I'm working on getting the I boat now. I have to figure a way to launch that ship Gladys found. What I need is a giant stork to deliver that big baby right here. Oh, we have a giant stork. Uh, with the crane. There is a crane that you could move. Right? Is that what it is for? And I, I guess I need to lower it down over here because it's not that far from the ship. Wait, what is this? They must bring the core over here to be crushed. Either that or these are the biggest, meanest looking hair colors I've ever seen. I'm not sure what to use them for, but uh, I'll figure it out. <laughs> right. Did that do anything actually? Okay, now it did. Right. Let me guess, you need to use the boss still to get a chain or something? <clears throat> also, did I talk to Mechi? I don't think I did. Afterwards. Maybe she has something to say. <laughs> there Where's the boat? Oh. Miss Colomar said we're going to ride in a boat. She said you were getting one. Well... I... Children, be patient. Mr. Calavera's a nice man, and he's trying to find us a boat right now, okay? It won't be that long now. I promise. Okay. okay. <laughs> I have nothing to do with the Angelitos. Wow! Wow. I don't think I've ever seen you in the sun before. <laughs> I swear, I'll get us a boat. We know, Manny. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you finally for trusting Manny. Uh, now I guess I need to get Gladys up with this. Perhaps. <laughs> I'm not sure. I, I can see why they don't give these chisels to the new guys. <laughs> Uh, well, it rusted away. This scoop looks heavier than my last ship. It's not a handheld device. Do I need to go? It's not a handheld device. Okay, okay, forget it. But I need to go get Gladys then. Oh, you still have it. Should I throw the bustle into this thing then? I don't know if I'm doing this correctly. <laughs> I had a hunch about this thing, I guess, but uh. I kind of remembered the puzzle with the door, though, slightly. It's, I remember it was annoying. <laughs> oh. I don't want to bust all that. Okay, you don't want to bust all at all. All right. We gotta go visit Gladys, then. Oh. What did I do? Wait, 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 wait. Why? 
What did I do? Is that what I was supposed to do? I thought I thought that I could use a chain for something, but what the heck did I use that for? What's in here? What are you? What? What? I'm very confused, guys. Did I just cut all the spare parts just so that Gladys can come and pick them up? Is that what I'm doing? What is... What? Manny, look at this, please. I can't believe I killed it. Yeah, you killed it. Maybe if I had some giant steel hair to curl. I don't need the hernia. <laughs> okay, okay, goodbye, goodbye. Okay, I guess I go get Gladys. <laughs> um, hmm. Okay, I totally... Okay, that was just a hunch because you can interact with it, but seriously, can I operate it? I guess I can, but just... That's weird. Oh, okay, now I gotta bring that downstairs. Alright. Um... Right. Oh, let me guess, I need to reverse the flow. Right, Manny, get down here. Please. That is if I'm doing this correctly. Yes, I'm getting this correctly, completely. Right. This way, Manny. And down to Gladys. Well, I guess this is how I get the chain for him to lift up the ship. And then I just reverse the flow. Right. Gladys, I got you a bunch of stuff, I guess. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but Wait. your idea's good too. Who did that? What? Who did that? Do you need to bust all Gladys? Hey, need one of these? Uh, that would have been easier to get her open than with my head, but it's too late now. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Uh, do I just reverse the flow then? That's it? Okay, <laughs> that's a bit, uh, unintuitive, I'll be honest with you. I'm just doing it randomly <laughs> right now. I, I'm gonna assume she probably, you know... Okay, I'm gonna assume that Gladys probably got this thing attached. Right, Manny, do your thing. No, that did do that didn't do anything. Um, no. Oh. Wait, what? Oh. I just got it attached. What did that do? Okay, I need to check what the heck that did. Or do I need uh -oh. to move the ship now? Another ship, the thingy. Uh. Okay, let me see if moving the crane will do anything terrible. <laughs> um, yeah, go this way. Right. Okay, wish me luck. Yep, apparently that was the correct thing. Gladys, I'm so glad to see you. Aww. Is the boat all ready? Yeah, come on. Let's go eat some reef. Wait, how does Mention know Gladys? Uh, I'm pretty sure she never Looks met Gladys. Like crazy. Full speed ahead. And we got some people with us too. What? Yep. <laughs> oh. He's an idiot. <laughs> so are you really going to bring me back and try to get your old job again? 
There's no job for me now except to bring you and everyone else here to the end of the road. But if you aren't going to use me to get your job back, why did you spend all this time trying to find me? Meche? I... I needed to find you. Octopus came. I give you one job, Manny. And look at you. Already screwing it up. <clears throat> well, this is not gonna I end. I suppose you realize that this is gonna go down on your permanent record. Yeah, mm, I don't think this is gonna end nice. Now the octopus is here. That's the squishiest looking periscope I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah. Hey, pull over, octopus. You're going too fast. I really prefer to use tongs when picking up octopus eyes. Hmm, okay. <laughs> well, hmm, okay. What about Domino? Look at him. Domino's just the kind of guy to practice Oxford regulation boxing and then pull out a blade when it comes time to fight. Uh. I don't think my bare hands would be a match for that sight to his. I don't know any wrestling moves. Yeah, okay, never mind. Use your own then. <clears throat> Ow. He just does Manny in. Woo! This does look dumb. Oh. I'm not gonna work for you. Oh, don't worry about that. You're fired. Just consider this your severance. Severance? <clears throat> What are you doing away from your desk anyway? I'm sending this domino back to the bone pile. <laughs> Smart strategy, always let your boss win. You know, your name is Domino, but you're really just a pawn. Please, save the comic book one-liners for when you're winning. Just like with your selling, Manny, you got a weak attack and no follow through. Ouch. Hey, I'll stop anytime you get tired. This fight is not going smoothly at all. <laughs> it's one sided, pretty much. <laughs> Just please stay down this time. I don't think he has anything good to say, but maybe if I bust this side, then... He didn't like it. <clears throat> I don't believe you, Calavera. You're losing a fight, so you pick on one of my pets? Why aren't you more like me, Manny? I've been trying to show you how, but you don't listen! If you just adopt the proper attitude, just look what could happen to you! You're an idiot. Come on, Manny! Oh, Angelitos! Oh, thank you, boys! Wait, this is La Mancha. La Mancha. Oh, that's what happened to La Mancha. And one year later... Well, Domino is an idiot. <laughs> he pretty much got what he deserved, but wow, this part of the game, man, I hate it. It's so unintuitive. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. I don't remember how it goes from here, though. <laughs> not, well, not that well, but... Man, they've been traveling a long way just to get here. Oh, uh, this is where the number nine goes off, doesn't it? I'll already Name. see you. everything. Pugsy Poligiano, sir. Hmm. Waiting room number two. Next. Glories! Uh... Glories! It has been. Gladys, where'd you go this time? Ooh, and this thing you changed again. Into skulls this time. Ah, oh, okay, so this is the end, I guess. Uh, mm, but anyway, we guys are actually out of time. 
Oh my gosh, I'm just glad we went through that part and I accidentally solved the freaking puzzle <laughs> without meaning to. I kind of remember something to do with the chain. I'm like, okay, there's a ship down there, gotta get out somehow. <laughs> the crane is probably the best bet. And wow, okay. <laughs> Anyway guys, um, thank you for watching, I really hope you uh, enjoyed this, and uh, I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye!